Okay, let's set this up. I'm on uh, Route 17 South in McClellanville, South Carolina. I am uh, in 14.2 in a Tesla Model Y Juniper. Uh, this is full self-driving. Now, this village is a speed trap. By the way, thanks for coming back. Please like, subscribe, share the video, and comment down below. I'm testing this FSD right here. As you can see, there's what I call the fake 50 mile per hour speed limit. We're currently at 65. It's going to drop down to 50 right here. Now let's see what happens. I've had issues here before. Okay, nothing's happening. Now this, I'm letting the car do its thing in full self driving, but this village is a notorious speed trap. So you may be about to witness me get a speeding ticket, but so far I'm in standard mode. We're still at 65 miles an hour. Now we're starting to slowly drop down. We're now at 64. Now we've got the, the double flashing yellow up here, which usually is a problem. Now we're down to 63, 62, 61. Now it's starting to hesitate a little bit, but not too much. Now we're down to 54. This is probably a safe speed limit to be going through here. There's another 50 mile per hour speed limit sign. And now we're coming through the village. And like I said, I'm in standard mode. Now the, the speed limit increases coming up here and it should I mean, so far, it's performing flawlessly. It would either speed through there like crazy, certainly wouldn't slow down fast enough, and many times in the older versions, it would uh, stop, not stop, but it would hesitate at that uh, flashing light. Now, here comes the 60 mile per hour speed limit again. Now, it should begin to pick up speed from here. Now, I'm still in standard mode. And I have the speed limit set uh, at 55 miles an hour. But notice on the screen, on the lower screen right here, notice right here, it's still saying 50 miles an hour. Now, why is that? Somebody in the comments explained that to me. For the longest time, that sign, that last 60 mile per hour speed limit sign was missing. It wasn't there. They just put it up about a month ago. But the car is still not reading that I'm in a 55, or sorry, in a 60 mile per hour speed limit. It still thinks I'm in a 50. And it's not increasing in speed. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to toggle up now to hurry and let's see what's happening. So now in hurry mode, it starts to speed up. Now we're at 59, 60, as you can see on the screen. So now it will probably stay around 60 because it typically does when I'm in uh, hurry mode. Oh, sorry. Yes, in hurry mode. So now let me toggle up to Mad Max and see what happens. So here we go, Mad Max. And it's still steadily staying at 60. Now I will say this. And again, I don't know how smart the mapping is, or the sensors are, or the cameras are, or the satellites are, or everything that makes this car work in full self-driving, but these are twisting roads. Now there's a 60 mile per hour speed limit again. So now we're at 61, 62. It's starting to creep up again. But for some reason, it's very cautious going through there. And I do have to say, today it performed flawlessly except for going back up to the speed limit after exiting that village. 
Anyway, tell me in the comments, what do you think? I appreciate you watching. Now we're going up 64, uh, 65. All right, well, I could go on with this video forever, so I won't. But anyway, happy Thanksgiving to everybody, especially all of those in um, the Tesla community, and obviously to service men and women all over the world who put their lives on the line every day to protect the United States of America. Thanks for watching.